I was uh, asked by the uh, CNES, uh, French National Agency for Space, in 75 to go to a meeting in the south part of France. This was a Soviet-French meeting for space uh, applications. And uh, they asked me to, to answer a, a question which was, are we able to measure the blood flow in the cosmonauts in the suite? outside uh, the station. Uh, so uh, I, <laughs> I presented what we could do. Uh, and uh, of course, it was very interesting for, ev for everybody, for both for the CNES and for the uh, people from uh, USSR. And when we uh, had a proposal to have a French astronaut on board the Salyut 7 station for a flight in 82, uh, the CNES asked me to uh, a proposal uh, for studying the, the blood flow in the carotid arteries. And I said, no, I would, would like to, to have a complete system in order to measure what happened on the, in the heart and also on the carotid and femoral artery. Because if we just study one part here, we don't know what happened on the cardiac structure, so it could do the, the conclusion, but it would be very difficult. So we had the first machine, a Codapla system on the space shuttle, developed in, in tour or so in, in, in France.